negative reinforcement. Removing a consequence that a student finds unpleasant. Turn your homework in. Please come up here, Caitlin. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. And Maddie, thank you very much. Madam, I so you've turned in all of your homework. So I'm going to give you a free homework pass for the next time we have homework. I feel good about what I got my homework class because my teacher said I did a good job, but I'm going to keep trying to turn my homework in. Punishment. Presenting a stimulus that decreases the frequency of an undesired response. All right, Daddy, after looking at example number one, let's try to do number two. Can you please track zero from two? Two. Two. Five minus two? Um, three. Eight minus six? Oh, um, two. two. I'm sorry, 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 i am sorry i am sorry i am um, maybe I should have time off. Instead of time off, I'll see you when we go outside of recess and you go to study hall. Thank you very much. I felt embarrassed because I had interrupted the whole class and I had to walk out of the room. Um, and I also had to miss my outside time. I'm never going to do that again. Positive reinforcement. Presenting a stimulus that increases the probability of a response. Today we're going to do some subtraction, and Caitlin, I was wondering if you could do number two on the board for us, please. And you did a wonderful job. Thank you very much. I appreciate the job you're doing. When a teacher says I've done a good job, I feel good inside and I want to keep doing a good job and trying my best.